Tomorrow is the day. Let's go out and vote in our masses. Use your card. Use it wisely. Even with our Nigeria flags raised up, we are still massacred. Hello guys. Good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening. Depending on where you are watching this video. The good day is here. And that day is tomorrow. You see, they had a lot of plans. And they successfully carried out those plans. They made things very difficult for the common Nigerians. They arranged some boys in the streets and make sure they cause commotions. They target to the scarcity of mirrors in the bank. But all is just for us to be afraid to go out and cast our votes. We have not forgotten the killing. The killing, the massacre that happened at Toll Gate. Even with our Nigeria flags raised up, we were still massacred. They still shot at us because a business was stopped for three to four days. Then they came back and told us to trust our nations in their hands. Is this the Nigeria we wanted? Is this the Nigeria we always prayed for? Are you afraid to come out on election day, February 25th, 2023? If you are, that means they are planned to work on you. Please, let us come out in our numbers. Let us come out as the youth that are ready to take back this country. Do you know that a common Nigerian, an average Nigerian, did not even know the source of his next meal? This is what they wanted. So that by the time they come into the polling unit and then give us some money, because we are already hungry, we take it from them and vote. Why some will not even want to come at all? But please, this is not the Nigeria we wanted. This is not the kind of Nigeria that we prayed for. Now there is hope. There is just one hope. Because at the end of the day, your other two parties, your favorite, they still go back together and hold meetings. Now it's like they are working together to frustrate the boy. It's like they are working together to frustrate that hope. After all, they call him an actor. But that actor is what we want. That actor is who we have chosen because he has given us the words of hope. He has made us understand that there can be a new Nigeria. They said that we do not have structure. Because we don't have local government um, house of rep, we don't have local government chairman, we don't have house of rep, we don't have nothing in the state level. But can I shock you? We have something. That is us. We have us. Yes, we will come out in our masses and vote. That is the structure. You that you are hungry, that you don't even know where your next meal will come from, that is your structure. You that you are holding your certificate, you attended school for years, and now you are back on the streets, and they said there is no structure, you should be the new structure. Yes. You that you have ideas, and no matter how you try to put them into work, the, the economy is frustrating you. The structure that they talk about is frustrating you. Then you are the new structure. I am the new structure. We that we are Nigerians, and yet look as if nothing is happening. We are the new structure. Those that were massacred at toll gates, they are the new structure. Even with their Nigeria flags went up, we are still shot at. We are the new structure. We are the one to go out and tell them no. Because when the boy become the president, 
that there is hope that you that is watching me one day you can also be a president when that boy that is said is just a boy when he become the president there is a hope that even me one day i might become the president of the federal republic of nigeria why those people that are supporting the men then that call themselves the men is because of what they can get for their selfish self it's because of what they can get for themselves i mean how long shall we be doomed to live for ourselves without even minding if others are dying because of the decision that we have taken tomorrow is the day let's go out and vote in our masses use your card use it wisely now that frustrates everyone we can't even travel to our state because there is no cash to use in traveling one of my friends traveled back to um, Roman West yesterday and he was telling me how frustrated his journey was but because he was determined to cast his vote on the polling unit I mean that is what all of us should do tomorrow is the D-Day do not sell your vote don't try it don't yes please don't if you are not tired of the suffering we are tired I am tired the well-meaning Nigerian we are tired please don't use your own to spoil our own we tell God beg you, just go out and make it peaceful, and at the end of the day, we will get it. Make sure you don't sell your votes. Yes, go out and use your power rightly.